What is going on guys? So today I wanted to show you the Firefield monopod and shooting stick. This guy is 63 inches. Um, it comes with an additional rubberized tip as well as a snow disc. So just in case you're kind of, you know, using this as a trekking pole in the snow or you want to have, uh, you can take this off. It's additional and removable. Um, but basically here's kind of the way it comes configured when you first get it out of the box. So it comes configured as the shooting stick. So here's your shooting stick supports here. It's got a nice cork handle, um, makes it really, really easy to hold. And you do have an adjustable wrist strap here so you can get a really good stable platform. Um, on the bottom down here, you've got your rubberized tip for your trekking pole side of things. Um, and then you've got your adjustments right here, uh, which you unsnap and slide them out. The great thing is that once you get to a certain point, it tells you when to stop and you lock it into place there. And then this top one up here is where you actually get the different measurements. So this is going to allow you to determine where you need to get um, as far as your height. So what I would do is do a lot of practice with this with your gun, uh, making sure that you know you can find the heights if you're in a kneeling position or a standing position, you get your comfortable and you just kind of mentally mark down which measurement you're at so you can kind of get to that really quickly in the event that you wanted to do uh, some shooting with this. So um, it locks into place. The, the locks are adjustable so you can actually unscrew them and determine how quiet or how strong, how tight they are. Um, so if you wanted a little bit on the looser side so you can actually make some micro adjustments to it on the fly you can do that um, or you can make them really tight so that they snap down and lock into place really tight as well so lots of functionality here but let me show you what it looks like with my rifle uh it, you know kind of in use all right guys so here it is um i've got it you can see i've got my strap here okay i got my nice my tight my tight strap kind of on here i like to hold it nice and tight this is going to help kind of support my arm in the position here okay there's my little V. This is where I'm going to put my rifle. Okay, I've got it selected. I'm actually sitting in a chair, so I've got myself in kind of a sitting position. Okay, um, I can extend, extend my arm out fully, um, and this is just going to give me that kind of swivel, um, and it's going to give me a really stable platform here. So when I take my rifle, I'm going to put this guy in place, and I'm immediately where I need to be, right? Now I can, I can then move it kind of however I want, which is really convenient. And this is where kind of the range of motion comes into play. Now this thing can get tall enough for me to get completely, I can stand all the way up and it'll actually be taller than I need it. So this can work in a lot of different scenarios. Plus this can go down even farther. So if I want to get into a sitting position, I can definitely do that. But I think the biggest thing is, is making sure that your wrist strap is nice and tight, right? That's going to give you a good solid platform. And now I've got a good tripod position here and I can hold this thing almost completely steady without wavering one little bit. So it's very, very convenient. The great thing is, um, is that you can actually, if you wanted to use this for a lot of different things, you could unscrew this, you could put your binoculars on here and you could do, you could glass with this if you wanted to. Um, you can use it for that purpose. Anything with a standard swivel on here, you can put this on here. You can put a camera on here. You can put uh, a spotting scope on here. You can really put anything you want. Um, you could even, if you wanted to. So I have a, Picatinny rail mounted to the front bolt of my rifle. So if I got a quick release Picatinny uh, adapter for the end of that, I could quick snap on and actually have it hard mounted on there. And that would give me uh, this hand free and I could do something along the lines of this while having that mounted there. So I would have no upwards and downwards motion and I could use my arms to control it. So a lot of different options here. So again, guys, if you're looking for a monopod and a shooting stick combination unit uh, or trekking pole, I should say, and a monopod shooting stick, uh, definitely check out this one from Firefield. It comes highly recommended, got great ratings, and I've really enjoyed using it so far. But as usual, guys, hopefully this video was helpful for you and I'll see you in the next one.